All right, uh, I just had some audio issues with Miles Edgeworth 2. I only saw a little bit of the opening cutscene. We're trying to begin here. Hopefully there's no audio crunch this time. Well, it was interesting that they went to the... And Jeff Masters, piece of cake. Went to the trouble to actually localize that. The, the fan translation theme is pretty cool. It's also cool that they tried to line up the meter of the lyrics here with the music. It's freshly baked desserts. Thanks for pointing that out, y'all. It didn't. I didn't hear anything in my ear. If it comes back, let me know. It's maybe a concern for the capture card. circumstances am I going to be forced to behave as a defense attorney yet again? IS-7 incident. does. Eighteen years ago during the winter. this. Okay. So this is what meeting a client is like. Thank you. 
wonder if we're gonna see like teen Edgeworth. Look at how old Edgeworth is. He's probably like ancient, almost dead age of 23. Jeff Master. The world's greatest pastry chef. Actually get to control Edgeworth's dad here in the flashback. It's a pretty good reason why this is funny. We're constantly like, looking for reasons for Edgeworth to be a defense attorney since we can't make a prosecutor game. This is one way to do it. Freshly baked desserts. Yeah, the cop doing the jazz hands is great. Do you get to play as Edward's dad? That's really cool. I'm glad they're willing to break formula so much here. I think I like the Miles Edgeworth games like strictly better than the Phoenix Wright games. They're still about four times as long as they need to be, but a little bit riskier, which is cool. Bringing happiness to all with his dreamlike desserts, huh? Game's maybe a tad loud. I'm gonna turn it down a bit. Let me know if it's too quiet. of your desserts. Isaac Dover. the eyes of a liar. Twenty nine, oh my God. funny though how badly they wanted to defense attorney stuff <laughs> 
That's me. Catherine Hall. Yeah, exactly. Should be in a retirement home. What is this piece of cake? animation. I hope this song plays into the solve in some way. son about this show. In consideration. This is what Ceylon tea smells like. Cool the tea. Okay. It is a cool, like, place to put the body. like an industrial amount of Columbo since last playing a Phoenix Wright game so definitely see how the original Phoenix Wright is super inspired by it where like the main like cathartic milestone of play is seeing someone who really has their shit together just completely break down it's kind of what Columbo does although he does it by annoying the fuck out of the person this game it's by presenting evidence in court or out of court in the case of Miles Edgeworth Okay, Ray. This room is really cold because of the desserts.
Tyrell bad, homicide. Kind of got a downgrade from gu <laughs> into Gumchu, huh? It's funny. much not to ask him to be concerned at all. that he has this like trailing off with ellipses way of speaking it's probably my favorite red herring character in the prior case where he showed up good. Oh, bad counts as my partner, okay. <laughs> Please be more serious. Investigation's like a popsicle. Walk around the crime scene and investigate. Talk with the people involved. Okay. <laughs> Truth will be written on the end of the popsicle stick. I pray it doesn't say the truth was lost for all eternity. of the body outline in the treasure chest. something breaking. The idea that like the ability to do basic logic is like a genetic power that only Edgeworth and his father have. Interesting. PH? I wonder if that in the Japanese it's um like a character that you can flip it mirror it and it'll say something different that's, I don't think they've done that yet although that's reversing left and right is like a rudiment of Phoenix Wright puzzle design
you start hearing the crime scene, I'll make you leave. And that's everything there was to see. Display of sailing equipment. that show is it cake kind of compelling actually like a meta modern like reality show This guy. Okay. be a dragon dancing in the sky. Okay. They don't do the punny names as much in the fan localization. Dane Gustavia? Candy pumps. Pump air into the candy. <laughs> no day has gone by where I didn't receive a burn or wound. <laughs> Making desserts a serious business. I'm always training. is the title of the world's greatest. There's also Sir Master's treasured angel's recipe. <laughs> oh, thanks, bud. Interesting. Hmm. 
What kind of person is she? A frightening woman who would do anything to achieve her goal. Love his like he's about to pull a pistol pose. They still make use out of it even though it's not relevant anymore. Chocolate frame on the wall. Hmm. Light of Life, Journal of Regret, Angel's Recipe. If you have a question about desserts, do not hesitate to ask. As expected of Master Jeff. Eh, this picture isn't made of chocolates? left corner uh, quick presents take that, take that. I like he's doing a Matt Berry impression. Sounds good. Someone tampered with the crime scene. Master Jeff wouldn't do that sort of thing to his desserts. The captain's log of a chocolate ship is also made out of chocolate. restrain yourself. No, I didn't feel like pressing it. It's because you're a defense attorney. It's <laughs> good.
Okay, it looks like this is the same, but it wasn't fast forwarding it because it was in a different context earlier. Show him shit. Didn't mean to select that. Oh, that's a punishing thing to accidentally click on. <laughs> I don't think I have anything to show him. Doesn't catch his interest greatly. He won't even give it a glance. Okay. What else is here? Fingerprints is the T set. Rather than the practicality, focus on the artistic merits. That same symbol. Initials, huh? Probably the main thing to find here. Jeff Master, age 39, oh my god. Delicious scones, it's pretty good. Said to use any means to achieve her goals. to present it. Fine, fine, fine. Yes, yes. I missed something here then? Oh, there's a second screen. Okay. Red rum. Murder. Failed six times. What an unlucky captain. Did detectives even exist during the ancient times? A broken piece. The stands aboarding the ship has been broken. You aren't serious about that, right? I love how they like 
just don't reveal basic facts <laughs> ever. I think those are the worst puzzles where it's like, unveil a basic fact. Well, there you go. Interesting choice. Such a convenient camera exists. Edgeworth logic. Probably breaking the sound and broken stand. Kind of appreciate how they made Edgeworth's dad just look like a regular guy, like they didn't give him like a crazy flamboyant costume or something. It's a remarkable amount of restraint for Capcom. Sand broke. Why did it break? Is that really true? Okay. So probably these two then, right? This has to connect to something. Yes? Okay, I guess. That I don't know. Okay, Mr. Bad. The crime scene. So you did something. <laughs> Funny, bad. It's your way of asking that's bad. Yeah, he's doing the classic Japanese localization problem. Ending your question with correct. There must be more to find here. It didn't give me something when I looked at this. It's this handprint.
finger marks without fingerprints. Okay, there we go. Detective Bad lacks dreams and romance. Cold in here. So turn down to maintain the chocolate's temperature to keep it from melting. connecting with that earlier. So as not to detract from the dessert's presentation, the cover was closed to conceal it. It's pretty cold, huh? Serving the crime scene as the foundation of being a detective. Enduring hardship is also a part of training. Ideal temperature for candy and fresh cream. I see. <laughs> Is candy one of Detective Bad's favorite things? Interesting. Party lights. I don't think I have anything else on the logic board, yeah. What else can I possibly find here? Let's say I can deduce stuff, so maybe that's it. to actually use the mouse for this. I said there was a contradiction with the crime scene. Can I see it here? The missing blood? Everything else looks like it matches. Please remove the crime scene was the body. Oh, okay. Yeah, that is it. Major contradiction has been created at the crime scene. Contradiction? <laughs> I 
I love the reverence with which they treat the word contradiction in these games, as though it's like something no one has ever heard of before. Forensics, no one has cleaned up any blood stains. Oh, that's a big deal. Hey, alright. I'm starting to get worried, like I feel like I've investigated everything. Anyone's still watching is the game audio is still fine, not all crackly. Use this key to the mansion. Okay, thanks. that. What's your theory? If the body had been found in a locked room, Master would have been the prime suspect. So my Master made sure to leave the door to his own room unlocked. I'm sure the body would be seen, Master broke the lid on the treasure chest. Yeah, but why would he... Why is the blood missing? at it real quick. Got it. It's not going to be the crest or the contest rules or the teapot. Could be the key. Fingerprints or finger marks. Before the ship's fall, the treasure chest lid was closed. Okay, so that's probably the thing I have to call him on. I'm sure the body would be seen. He broke the lid on the treasure chest. Suck it, bud. It's not true. Objection. said Mr. Master broke the treasure chest lid himself. But that seems stupid, you idiot.
fingerprints on the door. Fingerprints are kind of junk science anyway. Most forensics are pseudoscience. Helps for movies, TV shows, and games though. You really a frightening woman who would do anything to achieve her goal? Obviously can't be her. I'm guessing it's uh, Hall. The assistant. Prosecutor Manfred von Karma. What? Nice. Colored. <laughs> Not what I was expecting. Being called a boy, even though I'm already 34. Well, he looks like I'm older than Gregory Edgeworth. What the fuck? Come on, Japan. <laughs> End up having the problem where it's like, it ends up being the person who would have the most satisfying breakdown. <laughs> Shit. The scary man came out of the candy castle.
I have no interest in the names of defense attorneys. Concept of discovery would torpedo these games. A mere detective. is a fan translation. solid fan localization. They even like recorded some new voice lines. If you do, you're going to eat that castle. Sixty-eight degrees. Isn't that too high for cream? Yeah, okay. This is a flashback playing as uh, Miles Edgeworth's dad. Recurring character. It's a red herring in a prior case. Fairies in a curious candy castle. Like delicious scone as British lady. Yes, he was only a greeting. Ray Ray. 
You have a way with British ladies. theory is it's the person who would have the most satisfying breakdown. Her would be, hers would be pretty good, actually. Now, he's, uh, Ray Shields. We have done a bunch with K, though. He's the one narrating the flashback to Edgeworth right now. What are you saying? Honest truth. Study his works, you say. For the sake of research, I hate some of his desserts. Isn't that like stealing food? It's super obvious, though. because of you. Water feature seems like over the top. Your son? Only in grade school, he prefers to read law books instead of fairy tales. <laughs> I'd like to be his friend.
Fresh cream melts too easily. Temperature is too high. Two big rocks are placed here. Hexagonal recess. Oh, probably the pillar things, okay. The giant strawberry would fit with the fresh cream. I was just hoping. <laughs> He's great. A blue cloth. Color of the cloth looks familiar. All right, so I think I can already connect some things here. Have the magical. Well, we can do high room temperature and fragile desserts. Magical genetic Edgeworth ability to make basic logical connections. My shoes got creamed because the room temperature is set at 68. Doorknob didn't break. Strong? A dessert? Is it made out of candy? Oh shit! Failed the is it cake test. That's fucked up. She covered things in fondant, basically. She go to jail just for that. He's probably good. Cloth and the rocks. Is she gonna melt? Making it seem like her like entire facade is like made of cream. Yeah. Special lamps made with rock salts. I'm experience the therapy.
frenzies. Okay, I assume the nicknames are like she's using excessively familiar suffixes or something. Sun could see this. Nobody noticed that? <laughs> ah. <laughs> I love... I love how much of the game is just, like, basic fact-finding. <laughs> wonder what that could be. Oh, shit. The detective is hard. <laughs> Salt in the sugar bag. Yeah. Oh, with that piece of evidence. Okay. Contest rules. Decorations not made from desserts are prohibited, made from salt, right? Gonna tell you like this is where there's a problem, right? Take that. Eureka or Eureka rather. Okay, looks like that was right. Surprised we didn't get this from just finding out that there was cream on the door handle. some amazing logic here. Okay, so beaten to death, bloodstained rock saw lamp. Was quick. Okay, good. Delicia broke the rules. These feel like they're the same thing. Like, I don't feel like I'm deducing something here. It's just two different ways to state the same fact, but okay. Yeah. Well, I've talked about this in prior Phoenix Wright episodes that, like, I think the core gameplay is good and the, the writing is pretty good. The concepts are good. 
but it feels like Capcom. It's like it's like they have like a a target number of puzzles they want the player to solve in each case, right? And they're like not willing to buckle on that. They're not willing to say, "Hey, we actually don't have any puzzles for you here. This is just going to be story or exposition, right?" So when they're not willing to buckle, they end up giving you things that are just like trivial fact finding presented as a puzzle, right? So from my in my point of view, the best Phoenix Wright cases and Miles Edgeworth cases are the ones where the fewest puzzles are like trivial, right? That they're all like, you're actually trying to discover something that's maybe even slightly hidden just a little bit. But I think if they if they were just willing to write them in such a way that it's like, hey, we actually don't have a good puzzle concept for this, so there's just not gonna be one, it would feel better on the whole. There've been a couple of cases in the Miles Edgeworth games that have had a pretty good ratio there, where like actually most of the things they ask you to do are in fact a puzzle and not just like a triviality. That's just kind of combined with my overall complaint with the series that, you know, each game is probably four times longer than it has to be. I really liked uh, Aviary Attorney because it's inspired by Phoenix Wright and it's like three hours long. Figure doesn't maintain itself. They did say how old she is. I think that she, her facade is made out of cream. I don't think she's real. It's all gone to waste. Oh, okay. She keeps many secrets. Like two kids stacked on top of each other have to go. Not fitting of a person aiming to be the world's greatest pastry chef. curious to see how bad is written in the original Japanese. They localized him with the constant ellipses. So he reads like a passive aggressive boomer talking on instant message chat. Inside the castle. The woman smells, but not a sugary sweet smell. He seems really mad about the desserts being faked. Okay. 
Unlike the other fairies, this one doesn't have a fluorescent cloth. Oh, okay, because it didn't get added until after I went in the castle. One cloth and a machine has gone missing. A rainbow light device. Oh, it's red. It's like a raging inferno. That's a new animation for her. such a like he's so out of touch of technology at the tender age of fucking 34 he looks like he's in his like 50s oh, okay I, was always I, was yeah, I thought i was done Wonder if that just didn't localize super well because she was like yeah it's a it's a device that lights up the cloth he's like i don't know what that is and then ray's like it's a device that lights up the cloth he's like oh now i see Prosecutor Von Karma. Why didn't you say something? What? <laughs> on Delicia. Master used the rock salt lamp to kill the victim. He then deposited the murder weapon in Delicia's room. He left the murder weapon at the crime scene. Master would have been the one suspected. He couldn't move the body, but it was easy to move the murder weapon. Oh, there would be no evidence pointing to a specific culprit at the crime scene. So that has to be the one that I challenge gotten a little bit better at like noticing which line has a thing that you can possibly put poke a hole in like understanding the formula of these games small earrings on one karma double his drip <laughs> so he looks like a castlevania character Press this statement because I don't actually know what to point out. Not this one. Uh, there would be no evidence, right? Hold it.
really object even outside the courtroom. Okay, so that is the right line. I just need to figure out what the evidence is. No evidence. I don't think that's helpful. Teapot does me any good. I assume the whole Pierre Hoquette thing is going to come up later. Here's the missing blue cloth. Yep, that's blood. they changed this one so that the hexagonal base like they didn't want to give you the rock salt lamp where it's obvious that there's a blood stain so they just tell you about the hexagonal base before you get to inspect it i guess we do the crime scene notes question mark see if he yells at and all the music cut out so it might be okay okay yeah health bars gone have a look at look at this photograph I think she's melting there. <laughs> I love that he's like sweating because of that. Tisk tisk. What? 
We can't stand in court. This is Ace Attorney Investigations. It's different. it earlier I guess this is gonna be their way to get around the whole von karma hasn't lost a case because it's never gonna make it to trial although it would be really interesting if they if you just lose like you know that you're right but you lose because of von karma's record Some doubts left in our investigation. Traces someone left behind. I'm seen. Seems like a big, 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 big problem. <laughs> to make desserts, do you?
the, with the fake desserts. Okay. I love the fan <laughs> voiced objection for Von Karma. He's not like Darth Vader. It's not cake. This is not something one aiming to become the world's greatest pastry chef would do. My shoes can attest to that. Pharmacist? Nani? That's a completely different occupation. Victim's room? Oh, that's what his name's supposed to be. Iced over. Okay, cute. Oh, it's like Isaac Dover? What are we going for? When she calls him Icy, that makes sense. I do like delicious scone. They melt. Yes, please. Thank you.
something like that happens? before the three-day pre-trial system was established. That's really interesting. I'm surprised we're doing that. Oh, we we're gonna stay in the flashback. Okay. So I have the incident file. I guess M Master Jeff is Master Chef. The defendant was found guilty of murder and is conserving jail time. Okay, uh, so this maps to the sign we saw before. Associated temperature, seasons, and constellations. Fuck the 79F room. I wanna go there. before Haven't you checked? Mask Damascus here. 
prior case. Replicas of the desserts that vanished 18 years ago. <laughs> take pictures of me. Just like the one you found out about 18 years ago. Yeah, right. I was trying to look at it to see if there was anything. I guess you could make out Sagittarius holding the arrow. That is right, eh? No, it's Taurus and Gemini. Okay. Well, as if that's the whole point. Saw lamps still. Thanks. Wanted you to see it as well. Effectiveness depends on the time in the situation and the opponent. and Pollux. Quick 
quite heavy. The ways of the ancient people must have been very imprecise. I suppose you're right. <laughs> it cannot be debated. Oh shit. What's here? That Gustavia, old Gustavia. Saw something no one should ever have to see again. This man, he can't be. Okay, so they're both still here. Delicia and the assistant lady. Hey, thanks, Time Maxis. Appreciate it. There's poison gas coming from it. Was he dead? The idea that they're all like still here. It's nice of him to say that Larry is his friend. <laughs> I think that's already established, but it's still funny. But a butts by any other name would smell just as much. time for once. Is that something to brag about? I have the same tea kettles. She was the one I was suspecting before. I 
Wonderful. polite but slightly odd. Sure doesn't. What is this unbearable atmosphere? from the stage at the tender age of 36. You know, her career is over. Jamie Lee Curtis or Bette Midler, there's a whole bunch of women who just get kicked out of the industry, essentially. Changed. 
then that was in the Winter Palace? Yeah. Yeah, they did set up the fire alarm earlier. It's a robust detection service. I guess there would be. It's the same as the Winter Palace. get confused about which was which earlier. Talk to Mr. Butts. Denim, it's cute. Never said anything like that. Old man falling over? saying when something smells it's usually the butt still holds true 26 years on oh <laughs> i forgot about this Ideas. Chess is just something that smart people do. Okay, wait and see. Gotcha. One of the funniest things in a video game.
Okay, that's actually potentially relevant information. doing here at the art gallery. I love that the, like the core feature of logic chess is just like shutting your mouth. <laughs> Just like a normal chess, I've now thrown three pawns at his pawn. Certainly well informed for someone without a pamphlet. <laughs> Speaking of watching an industrial amount of Columbo, one of the Columbo villains is a chess master. That's a good episode. information regarding the Winter Palace. I guess he like outright tells you if you have to wait. I have no more use for you. You're supposed to wait and see when they're like off topic essentially it's hard to tell unless if he like outright tells you what he wants you to do weren't for that poison gas incidents
something scary. I feel like doing logic chess against Larry is kind of silly in the first place, right? It's certainly that kind of like, we need to fit in a puzzle here. Who are we going to logic chess with? I don't know. A guy who's really bad at saying what happened. That was a complete waste of time. Okay. Whatever you say, game. Oh, we already know that something's fishy. Yeah, because it's the pamphlet, right? Take that! Yeah, idiot. Harry Butts. Seems helpful. What the fuck? Larry's, this picture is scary. like basic fact finding sequences right where it's like we, we get a little bit of gameplay just because larry's it's not even that he's a dumbass it's like he's specifically like his brain is hooked into the game's code so that for no reason he just doesn't tell you relevant facts Tears of blood turned the Gemini sculpture into a fish. Sure did. Even a sketch like this can be used as scrap paper after all. like the opening bit with uh, Edgeworth's dad, but I have no idea where it's going right now. It seems like we're setting up a lot of weird shit with, like, melting ice sculptures and autumn and winter rooms that are actually copies of each other. Poison gas. that hairy butt sky. Larice to him. Melted part of the statue and there was an earlier statue on the inside or something.
So it wasn't actually poison gas, it was melting something. Fluorescent cloth is back. God, that's so stupid. <laughs> Come on, game. Yes. salary. Should I raise the salary? at once from this holy site. Normalium and Fatalium. <laughs> That's funny. Normalium is a red liquid. Yeah. 
Megatoxin X. Incredible. It looks like it's like a hot sauce. Pink. Okay, got it. Like the pink pool in the picture. <laughs> That's a good question. I think that fan localization has maintained the fiction of the Phoenix Wright games that uh, it's in America. It's totally in America. It's totally in California. Totally. Kind of a fun little localization challenge to keep up after all this time. This prosecutor's kind of an idiot. He has an idiot haircut. was the first to discover the victim so naturally he's the best suspect what the fuck are you talking about no what <laughs> god what a dipshit The only thing I leave behind is my bond of love with you. Objection! Objection! Dumbass. Listen to the explanations of others. Really? said that he was going to study in Jungfa.
Yes, the pink puddle. See the puddle here, right? Yeah, it's like obviously in the corner there. Take that! That oh, was it, not right? Oh, okay, it was. I like this case and I like the idea of jumping ahead 18 years from his father's version of it, but this part is very stupid. <laughs> and like, unnecessarily contrived given that they were able to set it up however they wanted here, right? With the 18 year time jump. Sometimes things are like stupidly contrived because they still have to like rely on evidence and characters from the prior session. But here we're throwing in Larry Butts. I think it could be okay to have a stupid sequence like this if the objective is comedy, where it's like, okay, you're like doing logic chess against an idiot because it's like really funny, but. be interesting to go back through all of the Phoenix Wright cases and try to find the one case in one of these games that has the best ratio of like high quality puzzle sequences where I don't think there's a single case that has absolutely no dumb fact finding bullshit in them right I think there was one in Miles Edgeworth one that was pretty close though it was maybe like 80 90 percent interesting So we better do this now, since we can't just wait to ask him tomorrow. Dress me with such a strange title. It's true. But is the key going to come back? Always. That's the very beginning of the case. Switch doors. Objection. 
That was easier than I expected. Wow. My reasoning was before its time. Assist. Okay, they're trying to connect the pharmacist thing, I see. I think that's actually a perfect example of what I was talking about earlier that like I think if they wanted to establish that there's these two different rooms um and they one was made to look like the other one through trickery and there is poison gas you probably could have done it in about a fifth the time if you just decided to drop having any like investigation sequences or logic chess sequences you could cut Larry butts entirely maybe he has to come up later I don't know She looks the same. 18 years later, huh? I think her. I think she's made of cream. <laughs> delicious scones. The pharmacist who makes delicious drugs. Boy, nice to meet you, bestie. Hall, I can't think of anything unless it's supposed to be catch all. Of course, the museum infirmary, the converted museum infirmary that was previously a cooking show studio. Got better. To defeat the Huns. It's a drug that's used to kill those things. It's mega effective. Say cockroach?
As expected of a pharmacist, she's very well informed. As expected of a pharmacist. Lots of little, very Japanese phrasings that make it through into the localization. That creature. Mr. Thief. be the person who breathed it in, right? Don't think anyone else makes sense. That's what there is a see. Oh, the music's still going. Wait. Oh, okay. I think that's okay. that I was paying attention. This is the true power of Sir Thief. I wonder if that's like a normal thing to say just in normal Japanese conversation or if it's just a really common anime thing. This is the true power, true meaning of X. Like Mr. Edgeworth's cold stare. 
Okay. It's weird. With heat, it has to be with this thing. All right. Take that. Take that. is just watching him do this. I think we're meant to understand that like Butts came in afterward. They like, saw him fall and then came in the room and looked at it and drew a picture. them don't have anything. As smart as me, hearing half the story will be enough. Top, that means best, right? you. Of course not. to kill cockroaches? Objection. 
open. So her and the curator are the only ones who can, and they're accusing her, so it can't be her. Not this, not this. The fluorescent cloth. Okay. <laughs> That's the port acceptance certificate. I normally carry that bottle of Megatoxin X in my bag at all times. <laughs> yeah, right? You never know when those things will appear. Thing is the culprit. Yeah. Do it in the past too. Yeah, there's economy of characters. My only option is her because it's not Larry Butts. Still suspect her as having done the original crime as well. Okay, thanks to best. Okay. I do kind of like him as making fun of the like prodigy prosecutor thing. Yeah. 
Oh, shit. that is. I don't think it's Kate Hall. Ice sculptures in the Winter Palace. Is that the, that's the thing we're most shocked about? just like 18 years ago. Oh, please let us go back. I was enjoying the flashback. It's also kind of cool to bounce back and forth in a case. Hey, hell yeah. Ice 7 incident. Okay, so whenever we get to the next checkpoint, that's probably going to have to be my stopping point here, regardless. Gregory Edwards last case. I know he lost it. ago. Cool. shares the same views as us. Yeah, and most of them are incorrect if most of them think that the cop shouldn't. Okay. <laughs> also, the system is fucked. Don't worry, the system is still super rigged against that person. Oh, those are the same candies that were in, uh... Delicious bag. Too sweet? As a child, I was abandoned. Okay. 
I've lived a long life. He said he's 34. I really gotta take Greg Edgeworth out back, like old Yeller. Put him down. on a liar. Interesting. I just sort of felt that way somehow. His dad doesn't care. I'm confident in my hairstyle today. <laughs> I do think the characterization is a very strong point. The only camera in this mansion. Flashback case makes a little bit more sense and kind of is setting up some more interesting, not completely, not total ass pulls, right? <laughs> Two or 20 photos. There's only your film for three more.
<laughs> Make sure you wouldn't need any more of the crime scene. Traditional American, thank you. It's a beautiful sherbet. Makes me want sherbet. One piece is so salty. The liar. That's why the strings are missing. Okay. Sculptor. Alphabet signature. the teapot. So is he actually the sculptor guy, I guess? Yeah. 
Same symbol? Puriket. A fan of sculptures, he's the sculptor guy. That to the police. Room. Objection. I thought you said the camera ran out of film during the judging. That's strange. Film remaining. I think it's this, right? It's not going to be the photo itself. Only room for three more. Yeah. I think that's right. I can afford the health, I guess. Okay, looks like that's right. Told a terrible lie. All shots of the ice sculptures from various angles. I melted them. Hold the plug. And you didn't notice it and plug it back in? Uh huh. I don't think so.
Always ready with a comeback. It was I who melted the ice sculptures. What's the meaning of this, you clod? suspicion of being complicit in the murder. Oh, is there going to be a checkpoint? That was quite short, actually. I mean, I, I have to stop here, though. Probably an hour left. Let's stop somewhere for hamburgers, then. Or my stomach joins the chorus. That's the uh, rare example of the localization team being cheeky. They're, they generally don't put a lot of inside joke stuff in there. Okay, so future Marstead, you're doing a case that spans across time. Part of it involves Edgeworth's dad, Gregory Edgeworth, with a then 18-year-old Ray Shields investigating a, like, cooking show where the guy who ran this, like, cooking competition is currently being framed, probably, for murder of a guy who was, like, a famous sculptor, but he was hiding the fact that he was a famous sculptor. Uh, the other players, there's a pharmacist lady who I think is, like covered in cream that's my theory that she's not a real like that there's like a outside of her body that's in a melt off during a breakdown scene later uh there's a guy in red uh who like studied in jung fa to be a candy designer he's really bad in the past he's pretty good in the future uh there's a recurring motif of like ice sherbet sculptures that melt of, of Zodiac statues and like the top half and the bottom half of the Zodiac statue causes there to be ambiguity as to what the statue of uh, is of in the present with Edgeworth, like Miles Edgeworth rather than Gregory Edgeworth. Um, there's this whole thing with like poison gas in a room and a dead body in a fountain and suspicions cast around Catherine Hall, who's the assistant of the guy who runs the cooking show. So write all that down. Good luck. The stuff that happens with Gregory makes perfect sense. The stuff that's happening with Miles is like weird ass pull stuff. So maybe it all connects at some point, but right now it's, it's all very strange. Maybe uh, to start a stream, just kind of review the evidence, especially when you switch back and forth between Gregory and Miles, they both have different um, things in their evidence lockers. So just read through them and review the profiles for all the characters and make sure you're caught up. Uh, I think that's it. I'll credit Max Knight sublock here. Make a save state just in case.